Hey guys, Pretty Bricks here. Welcome back to another video. Today I've made a custom Jimmy's Bob minifigure, and I don't really have anything else to say, but let's take a closer look at this James Bond minifigure. So right here is my custom James Bond minifigure, and thing to note, this is also based off of Ashton Flash's design from the Create Your Own CMF Draft video, I think, but I decided to make this also because a ton of people were disappointed that James Bond didn't come in the Aston Martin set which was kind of disappointing. I made this custom, and I don't watch James Bond, but I figured since a ton of people wanted a minifigure of him, I decided to make one. And let's start off from the top, and the top right there. That hair piece is like Superman's hair, and that is in a brown color. That appeared in a couple of sets, which this hair piece is pretty common. And the face print right there is from Captain America from Captain America Civil War, and that was from the Black Panther Pursuit set. And right there, he has a confident expression, and if you flip it around, he has like more of an angry expression. And moving on to the torso, I got that torso from the Bruce Wayne from the Batcave set, and that was from the Lego Batman movie, so that is a perfect torso for this minifigure because this matches James Bond character in the movies, TV shows. Sorry, I don't know anything about James Bond, but... Oh, and also, uh, James Bond also has, like, a bow tie. So in Ashton Flash's design, it also had, like, a bow tie on the torso. But this torso right here, sadly, didn't have any. So, you could possibly use the bow tie from the Bruce Wayne minifigure in the back here, which is the same set that the torso came in. And I'll show you what the course looks right now with the bow tie. That is James Bond with the bow tie neck. I think this is a bit too big, but you can add this accessory to the neck right there if you want to. But that was just a quick suggestion if you wanted to add to this minifigure. I decided to add a bit of more arm printing by adding a little bit of printing right there. And the arm printing right there is actually from the Gourmet Chef from Series 17. And that adds a bit of pretty cool detailing to this minifigure and sadly I couldn't I like add any more detailing on the legs but I've decided since like the torso comes down to the legs right, right there I've decided to also use the legs from the gourmet chef from series 17 and that adds a bit of cool detailing to this minifigure and I'll give you a 360 look at this minifigure so that is the front that is the right side that is the back, a little bit of printing at the back right there, and that is the left side, and that was my James Bond custom minifigure. So I hope you enjoyed my custom James Bond minifigure, and if you have a suggestion for my next custom minifigure, please leave a comment in the comments below, and I hope you guys enjoyed this minifigure. If you're new here, please leave a like and subscribe if you want to, and thank you everybody for watching, and we'll see you in the next video. And bye. <laughs>